If you eat a low carb diet, whether it's a ketogenic diet or a paleo diet or just an Atkins diet, okay, what it means is you're reducing your total carbohydrate and hopefully sugar, and you are raising your dietary fat. So you will generate a higher LDL, but it's gonna be that large buoyant LDL, which again is cardiovascularly neutral. That's not the bad guy. On the lab slip, it looks like the bad guy because of these reference ranges that make no sense. But ultimately, the goal is get the small dense LDL down and statins don't touch those. The other issue about statins is that 20% of people who go on statins either end up with uh, inflammation of their muscles called rhabdomyolysis, or because statins are actually a mitochondrial toxin by themselves, end up with hyperglycemia, actually frank diabetes. So the question is to lower the LDL that's not important, but to put yourself at risk for hyperglycemia, which is important, is that a good trade? 